We're in New York City, and today we're gonna walk through all of Manhattan and buy a slice of pizza from every pizza place that we see that sells slices. Let's go. Let's do it. So we're starting here at 59th Street, Columbus Circle, and the idea is just to walk Ooh. straight. If you see a place that sells pizza, we're gonna get some pizza. So we're walking south. Maybe we'll get all the way to the Lower East Side. Uh, Which is diagonal. But you know, but we're gonna walk south, and, and every time we see one, we're gonna go buy a slice, take a bite. Is it good, is it bad? Because I know that New York City is the, the pizza capital of the world, but how many good places are there? Do they actually outweigh the amount of bad places? It's an important question. And well, we got some friends with us here today. We got a whole crew. Come along. It's a pizza parade. The pie's the limit. The pizza parade. That, that's gotta be a title card, I would I think. Feels, feels good. It feels good. It feels good. So there's a very loose plan for today, okay. and I like to plan things. Uh -huh. And Keith said, no, we'll just go with the flow, which is not how production usually works, so I'm a little nervous about today, but it's gonna be fun. I have a favorite pizza place I wanna make sure we hit, and it's Joe's on Carmine. Oh, I hope that we see it. Pizza. We're gonna see it. <laughs> Where are we going, Keith? Look out, this is Broadway, the street of theater. So we're gonna walk starting this way, because this is where most tourists are going to be centralized. And most tourists are just gonna buy a slice from the place that's closest to them, especially at like two in the morning when you're drunk. Oh, here we go! No way. Bakery pizza. So come on, let's go grab a slice. And specifically, I was going to only order cheese pizza. Hey, how you doing? Good, can I just get a slice of cheese pizza? I figure if you can make a good cheese slice, you can make a good everything slice. Thank you very much. We got it. Let's got go. It. Pretty good New York slice. It's way better than it looks. Oh, the crust is excellent. I'd give it a 3.5. I thought it was pretty good. Pizza, 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 pie. Uh, simultaneously throughout this video, you know, I don't really eat pizza, I'm gonna be a little crust boy, but I will be reviewing every beverage I find. First up, San Bendetto Sparkling Water. Not a brand I was familiar with, but the bubbles are delightful. We're walking towards my least favorite place on the planet which is Times Square. I think when people come to New York, they assume that you need to and should go there. You don't and you shouldn't. Will this pizza be good? It's really hard to say. Hey, 99 cent pizza. Bam. Can I just get one slice of cheese? Okay, this looks like a normal slice. One dollar, 99 cent pizza, <clears throat> cash only. Way better than I expected. Way better? <laughs> it's, it's fresh. Three, two, okay, well. Me. <laughs> that's great pizza. I think that's pretty good. I'm wondering now if every single place is just gonna be good. Pizza, 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 time. I said time and they said pie. Uh, one slice of cheese and can I grab a, is there a sparkling water? I didn't get any drinks at that place. No, let me tell you, if you're ever in New York, Poland Spring, my personal favorite water. They were nice. They asked where I was from. It looks identical. It looks like the same. To the 99 cent pizza we had before. This one's very soft on the bottom. That's the only I can pick. Look at that flop. Whoa. You gotta do the fold. You gotta do the fold. Oh. Wow, the cheese bowl. That's what you want. The taste is not as good as it looks. A little too wet, a little too goopy, a little too soft overall. The crust is not good. I would say that one's the worst that we've had so far. But it looked good, didn't it, audience? I don't know if we're hitting 50 places. Oh, we're hitting 50 places. <laughs> Check out our new Keep Trying merch on TryGuys.com. I'm gonna keep trying to find some more pizza. Let's go. So we're leaving our maybe fourth place and Miles just realizes he doesn't have his backpack. <laughs> he has to run back to get his backpack. Zach takes over the camera. We'll meet up with you, Miles. Good luck. And decides this isn't a pizza video. This is a video of beautiful footage of New York City. We're now on 48th and 7th, and we see pizza, and a psychic greeting, and a tattoo. World's best pizza. Whoa. It is right off Times Square, so it does, I don't know if that means it's good. <laughs> oh, I think it's actually bad. There he is, you see him? He's that little guy. He's that little, you gotta do a real digital zoom, because this zoom, this is as far zoomed in as I go. No, we're gonna go that way. No, there's pizza right there. We missed it? Yeah. We missed it. The vibe in each shop. I love it. Okay, we got a nice looking slice. Ooh. 
big bite. Not really good, but I think it's pretty good. I've heard about the upside down bite. Have you ever tried that? Oh, the tongue down? The yeah. Spider Man bite. The Spider Man bite. So that way you get the cheese on the tongue instead of the roof of your mouth. Okay, we're just trying. No, new I've things. heard that's good. Oh, oh that was the worst. Oh, <laughs> what a way to ruin a slice of pizza. I wanted a piece, but it looks now good I don't. though. I put it in the three to three and a half. You do another video where you eat all the nuts on the street. <laughs> All right, gross. Sugar nuts. <laughs> we are at my least favorite place on the planet. Five dollars for the gorilla? Right. Yeah? Can you pretend you're eating a slice of pizza? Muevete, muevete, muevete. Muevete. Okay, now, now, you're, now you're stealing us. You're stealing us and we can't get away. Oh, no! He's got us! He's got us! Oh, he's got us! He's got us! Oh, he's got us! Okay, we'll all right, thanks, man. Thing, we have to get a slice from every place we see, which means we're going to Sabaro, baby. Mama Sabaro. <laughs> I didn't know that it was a mama. I didn't know it was a mama either. Oh, maybe no. it's. Oh, no! Maybe. maybe. Oh, no! Uh, it's out of business. That's heartbreaking. <laughs> this is so sad. We'll miss you, Sabaro. We see a sign that says pizza, just on the other side of the street. Okay, this one's really hot. They really nuked it in that oven. Good. Very pretty. Needs to be folded. The way that your tongue lapped that in was just awful to look at. Your tongue <laughs> is the mouth, the mouth's hand. I'm sad to report, it's not good. Really? really the Times Square pizza? Wait, what's your rating out of five? Oh. 1.5. That's a 1.5? Yeah. History has its eyes on pizza. I am not throwing away my just you eat. I am not throwing away my just you eat. I am not throwing away my pizza, 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 just you wait. So this one is from Pizza Cafe. Oh no. Are we getting worse as we go on? Very mad. Starts has a good texture, it tastes like nothing. It's not good. <laughs> no? Famiglia's? I would rate it below a one. A real quick intermission into this video. While we are eating pizza, Zachary's not eating pizza, and it's one o'clock, so I'm gonna leave and get lunch. Oh, this is a chain. Yes. This is like yeah. a sub lower than Sabaro. I'm gonna get a slice of cheese. I'm getting really dehydrated really fast. Oh, oh is it so hot? Uh -huh. Are you a hot little mouth boy? No. It's bad. Do you want to just walk for a while? Not stop for like 10 minutes? I'm going to stop. Everyone keeps questioning me, be like, hey, let's actually just skip a few places and just like get further down because we haven't left Midtown yet. And I'm like, sorry, that's not the conceit of the video. The video is I stop every time I see one. And that's how it works. I don't have a goal of getting to a certain place. I have a goal of fulfilling my promise. That's the video. We need to divide and conquer now, and Sens will be able to get some pizza. There's supposed to be a slice that's just up this street, and you guys go down to that next one and just buy a slice of the next one you see, and I'll meet you there. Stop at a Kiss My Slice Pizza Cafe. Hello. Can I get one slice of cheese pizza? One dollar fresh pizza. Bam. Here we go. A little stiff. I'm sorry, it's bad. Let's try it. I don't think I want it. This is the awful crust. Uh, it's only getting worse. Here you guys go. This one's from Kiss My Slice. This one looks pretty okay. Pizza has a lot of flavor, especially compared to the last five places we've had. I don't know if it's actually good, or I'm just like, wow, those other ones are so bad. I think I need some ice cream. So this is 99 cent fresh pizza. This is 99 cent delicious pizza. They're very different looking. Look yeah, at that. Different. Look at, let me just look at them. Point it down, hold it. Show them, show them in. The just hold on to the slice with your hand. Ooh. For a dollar, it's better than some of those $5 ones we had. Maybe a 2.5. Uh, let's try the crust. Bland, but kind of in a nice way. Like the Tony's frozen pizza has a bland crust, but it's kind of like a cracker. Right, let's try a 99 cent delicious pizza. This is bland as I don't agree with them at all. As, you don't think that's better than some of those really bad ones? This tastes like a bad grilled cheese. I like grilled cheese. Bad grilled cheeses? I think this one's worse than that one. 99 cent fresh is way more delicious than 99 cent delicious. We're about halfway through. Overwhelmingly not good. Problem is when something's like bad and costs $5. Yeah. That's not a good look. For New York City to be the pizza capital of the world, on average, the pizza should be good. We'll keep going. 
We're so excited. Yum. So while everyone else is eating pizza, I met Maggie. We're at a vegan restaurant. And I got an eggplant lasagna. We're leaving the park. Everybody's looking for caffeine. Ned just got here. Just second wind, Fulmer. It's called an Act 2 energy boost. Hell yeah. Ned, what's the craziest place you ever did it? Huh, in a pizza shop. <laughs> That's right, my man. Nah, 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 nah. What is the craziest place I've ever done it? Can I just get one slice of cheese pizza? Let's have a taste. Well, this is my first pizza of the day, so I'm like, hell yeah, brother, it's pizza. It's so but no, this is, it's crazy. this is objectively it's not school good. pizza at best. What is your perfect pizza? What are you looking for in a slice? Well, the sauce should be a nice salty and sweet. It should have some sort of herb flavor, maybe a little garlic to it. The cheese blend, I should be able to either taste a good mozzarella or I just should enjoy that cheese blend. A Little bit of stretch, a little bit of black on the bottom if we can, crust to have enough salt that you, it tastes good just to eat it by itself with no dip. That's Gotta what I want. The leopard spotting. The leopard spotting would be a dream. This one. You know, it's more of a house cat. But we got another pizza right here. Yeah. Yeah. Dang. Bravo. Kosher pizza, baby. It's fresh. Whoa, wow. Zach here. Zachy. Whoa. Zachy boy, what you brought me? Oh. Wow. Whoa. Whoa. Where's this from? Kiss my slice. I just got oh. completely sidelined in a hilarious way. Let me say Whoa. that this one looks good, but it's also hilariously yeah. greasy. But I'm, I'm into it, and there is We're one. We're talking kosher. Really? Oh, this should be greasy. Oh, no. Ew. Oh, no. No, 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 that's not kosher. Baked into the pizza. Actually, hair might be kosher. That's it's not amazing. Because of the hair, I'm going to do something dramatic. What kind of? Of course, there's a little bland. I mean, it's a very good looking slice. What kind of animal? I guess I'll put it in a 2.5 to 3. We'll take it, semen tofu, muzzle tofu. This place is probably like 1.5. Man, all three of those slices we just had are, I would say, disappointing. So I ordered a chocolate chip, and then when I got to the actual ice cream part, they were like, we actually don't have chocolate chip. I feel like we're getting off topic here with the ice cream <laughs> review portion of the show. Uh, you were very nervous in the beginning. I would say this is going better than expected. Yeah, we've hit more pizza places than I thought we would. And, and they're all bad. They're all bad, and I can't wait for a good one. <laughs> At least the sound is good. Huh? We have a slice of Joe's pizza. This looks pretty good. Big bite on Joe's, that's good. Well, Ned took my first bite, which is supposed to be mine on every single pizza. Oh, did I break so, the format? A little bit. It's pizza fatigue. Yeah. It's hard to really tell what's good anymore. Pizza I'm looking for more noise. We're gonna have to ADR this whole video anyway. I think it's not that good, or else we would think it was good. It's not good. If it was good, I'd put this in my mouth and go, oh! Probably a three. It's fine. Probably a porta potty at a music festival. <laughs> okay, cool. He was answering my viewers' question. Where was the weirdest place you ever did it? <laughs> I'm so tired. really nothing special. Let's go! Alexandria has really been pushing. Let's just at least go to one place that we know is good. Eventually, we do just sort of make our way to one that is apparently one of the best slices you can get in the whole city. <laughs> No, oh, no, no, you gotta be kidding Tragedy. me. They're supposed to be open, but they're closed. Alexandria's trying to knock on the door, be like, when will you open? Maybe if we just stay for 15 more minutes. This really, I think, kills the energy of everybody. I can tell that the mood is, everyone else is done. To them, the video's done. But not to me. I'm just gonna hit as many pizza places as I, as I can on the way home. I'd like to get to 30, so it's just gonna be me now. 
And, and Jared Popkin's gonna come. That's, I'm gonna spot him. He's gonna spot me. I'm gonna spot him. No, you can't. I gotta go, guys. You can't. I gotta go. I gotta finish this pizza thing myself. And for I'll, I'll roll my own camera. Okay. Bye, everybody. Bye. We gotta find our pizza. How many of them are good? That's what we gotta find out. Maybe we'll be able to go back to sauce at the end and it'll be open. How can this be such a pizza town if the pizza overall is just okay? Can I get one slice of cheese? It's definitely hot. Full hot. No, it's not bad. Okay, let's keep on moving. There's another one, I think, across the street. It's got a cute little sign. Can I get a slice of cheese? I'm not New York in here. No. Hey, can I get a slice of cheese? Let me see that, look at that. This, it looks like there's almost no sauce on it. It's satisfying without necessarily being delicious. I like the proportions of sauce to cheese. We're on the men. It's okay, right? Dude. Feels hefty, folds, smells good. I'm gonna give this a 4.5. Wow! I think it's really good. It's, it was a dollar. By far the best dollar piece I've had today. I'm gonna be honest, I was not anticipating such a high review when we got it. The crust is bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're gonna bump it back down to a four. All right, give it to me. Give it a try. This is great. Whoa, cool. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Uh-oh. There it goes behind you in the distance. <laughs> it reminds me of mall pizza. The crust really brought it up for me. That, that, the crust is quite good. The place is called Marinara. I probably like the sauce the least. We're walking back to sauce. Let's give it one more try. It was closed an hour ago. I gotta end on the best pizza. What is really happening? Pizza. Well, we tried coming back to sauce pizzeria, but their POS system isn't working. Their POS is being a POS, if you know what I mean. <laughs> This pizza, oh, they can't hold itself up. It's like a three, they're all three. They're all in the threes. But I can't end the video like this. And then a young girl walks by. What's your name? Maggie. The one thing we didn't do today is ask someone who lives here where we should go. I say, where do you go? And she says, oh, a place really, really close to me. I'm hoping this is amazing. We hope it. <laughs> We're bumping a lot on you right now. It better be good. There it is. Here we go. Hopefully the last slice. We're out of pizza. Can I get two slices of cheese? It looks pretty good. Grab your slice. Okay. It should be cool enough. Okay. enough. Probably not. Okay, cheers. It's fine. <laughs> Keith, what's your conclusion from all this? Number one, don't get cheese pizza in New York. Two, put shit on the pizza. Garlic salt, oregano, red chili flake. You're gonna wanna use that. And number three, if you're making a video about pizza in New York, I think you should look up some good places to go in New York and go there instead. <laughs> Listen, <laughs> Keith. But I wanted to find out what are the odds, and the odds, to be frank, are low. Do not let this man <laughs> march through in Midtown and make a conclusion about pizza in a city. This is insanity. Here's the thing. The Here's the place. thing. Of course you I didn't go to the good place. place. You said uh, just still my video. A tourist would just go to what's closest to them. So that my thing is that New York should put some money into making sure those pizza places that are close to the tourists are good because that's the impression people are getting of your city. Tax dollars? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay, how about we do a video where we're gonna eat every taco in LA and we'll see how many of those are decent, huh? I think they'll be pretty good.